All right, carrying on. Yeah, so Jerk's Pat gonna Jerk Online will be arriving late because he's probably eating dinner by now. Hey, Paul, stop texting. Jesus. <laughs> His granddad is sleeping. Wait, are you? No. Hey, can you hear me? Can you hear me better? A little bit. We um, hear you wait, from the very start there. Wait, can you hear me at all? A little bit louder. Can you turn it a little bit louder? All right, let me see. Because I was too loud before. Was I too loud before? No. No. Yeah. Um, All right. Uh, what the hell? It says it's fine. <laughs> what the hell? Okay, yeah, it's it's back to where it was before. I don't see why it's work not working. Mm. Oh, let's see. I'll put input. No. <laughs> Hello. Yep. Is it? Oh, wait. So do I? Sound okay? Can sort of hear you. Still coming in a Fucking bit hell. quiet. Fucking hell. Uh, no. Is that it? Uh, I don't know how this freaking works. I don't know why it's not working properly. I'm not speaking up enough. Hey! Any luck? Me? Yeah. Oh wait, oh wait, does that sound better or no? Yeah, let me just move it closer. Alright. Here, does that sound better? Much better. Great. Much better. <sighs> Sarah, are you still there? I'm dead right now. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm about to pass. <laughs> Can uh, either of you give me some feedback on this, like my artwork that I'm working on? Sure. Put screen share on. <laughs> there, can you see it? Mm-hmm. Looks all right. very good. Um, it's just that the background is a bit empty, that's all. Because it's that a racetrack. Um, but I don't know what's gonna go in the background, because I know there's supposed to be, like, stores and, or different booths and stuff, so... I just don't know how to design it, or I, sh I should just, like, use a smaller version of this asset, or just, like, uh, see if there's any other assets I could use. Let's see, I could use this asset here, that'd be good. Maybe. <laughs> We can, we can hear you. Your mic's muted, Blaine. Yeah, your mic is muted. <laughs> you dildo. I'll see. This would be good. Um, wait, what? Voice calling in my room, Mom. By the way, hi. Uh, why are we starting your food? Even it might work, I don't know. Because it does that to me before. Yeah, that looks really nice, Koi. Thank you. Wait, let's see, because I have a Hey, I'm in the same country as you as well. well and you spot um, but no. I think you come from the UK. Oh, yeah, oh, Blaine. Yeah. Uh, restart your thing. I don't know. Hey, Our country is sure. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I do. Yeah, does that look sure. a bit better that I had a few things in the background? I mean, it needs to be more. Jeez. Oh, now you can see me? Alright. <laughs> yes. Okay, that's why. Yes, like... Oh yeah, we have like a Discord server. I know. Yeah. Yeah, I've well, seen. she'll be added to the Discord server later on. Yay. 
Yeah, he was he was ranting about um government in England. <laughs> Spelling S U C I N G. It's Oh, I don't. I guess background. Right now. Spell whatever you want. Yeah, it's fine. We're not grammar Nazis here. <laughs> <laughs> I've got slime on my fingers. Oh, you made Yay! Slime. Oh, you make you made slime. Uh, actually, I made what well, the fuck I made? Gooey slime, watery slime. I don't know. <laughs> oh, you sick! Explain! <laughs> that was so funny. <laughs> a dirty, like a watery slime. What are you thinking? What are you, what are you thinking? Child. <laughs> Alright, our guest is here. Hey, man. Hey, Whatever person, I don't know what your name is, sorry. Uh, just call him Jerk. Short for Jerk Online. Hello. Jerk. Jerk? Hi. Is that the... Yeah, this Hi. is my friend Sarah. Hello, friend Sarah. <laughs> <laughs> it's just Sarah, thank you very much. Not... <laughs> yeah. Uh... By the way, congrats on your new video. I just saw it earlier today. Yeah. I will come out there wherever you live and I will chop your balls off, okay? If you do stop being dirty, my I will eat. I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Blaine, uh, he's okay. a naughty one. Okay. Don't worry, I'm dirty minded. You're not the only one. I, I'm more dirty minded than anyone in here, so. <laughs> <laughs> yep. All right. Well, wait. So... Are you still recording? Yeah, it's still recording. Oh, we're live. Um, no, we're I got live. the OBS running in the background, so we. I guess we are quote live. Oh no! Oh, it oh no! It's fine. Okay. <laughs> Don't worry. It's fine. You got a strike from her channel. So... So yeah, yeah, I remember that. I remember that. Yeah. Yeah, I made a video it, on that. Yeah, because of the stupid community strike that I got. And because of the strike, yeah. I can't actually live stream. So I have to do the OBS route. Can you guys still see my screen? Hey, wait. Yeah, what what, what, what was Esso's third strike for? What, what did he do to get the third strike? Does anyone know? Well, his channel got terminated after two strikes. Yeah, but I thought I thought it took three strikes to terminate your channel. Yeah, it usually does, but for some reason, um, YouTube sl slanted over their own policy rules just to terminate his original channel. Oh my god. Oh. I guess I'm Blaine's gone off then. Okay. I guess. Mm hmm. <laughs> Well, this oh, guy doesn't no. even have a profile picture. I don't trust him. Uh, Blaine, he's <laughs> cool. He's a friend. <laughs> I was about to make a joke about um, Jerk about his yeah. profile picture, but <clears throat> never mind. I drew this on paint. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He... I took inspiration from grade A under A. Grade eight? Grade A. Or grade A. Grade yeah. under oh. A. I think that's oh. the YouTube channel. I'm familiar with it. I've seen like one or two videos from that YouTube channel. Um, a friend, uh, Darth Revan, showed that to me. I just been. Yeah, he was cold and he got depressed and stopped uploading. I can you hear it? Right now. Yo, can you hear it? Yes. 
Yay. Yay. <laughs> Yeah, you can actually control the fucking the fucking volume on the yeah, phone now. How does that work? <laughs> the Kindle. Does that push make it feel? Did you say Nintendo? What? Did you say Nintendo? <laughs> no, I said Kindle. Kids in the playground. Nintendo did Columbine. <laughs> No, I did, Columbine. Stop, say... stop attributing credit for other people's work. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm for the people's work. Oh, honey, seriously, stop using credits. <laughs> what? What? What if it was crack? <laughs> oh, uh, Boom Kid, hey. Who invited him? Did you just say I was a... Just, uh, just asking. Hey, Blaine, did you invite him? Hey. What? Hey. 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 Yes. No, I didn't know what you were talking about. Four B. Looks like that we Did have that see? trick online. Hello. Oh, hey, the um, boom kid. Um, boom kid. Yeah. Anyways, back to the conversation you? about slime. Yeah, I tend to have that effect on people. Who are you? Hey. Are you? I'm just a random troll on the internet. I don't know how I got here. Hi. <laughs> well, I invited him. Um, I believe there was something that um, Jerky wanted to. Um, oh, we were gonna do like a interview or something like. Uh, you in the political spectrum, your journey there, or? Uh, sure, if you want to do that. Sure. Go over for whatever. Sure. What, what, what is happening? Just I as think we agree wait, on, wait, wait, like, an interview. And, um, you know, you can ask, and everyone else, free to ask him Oh my questions. god. Can anyone hear me? Yep. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Oh, we can't hear you. I'm joking, we can. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hell, it's working. All right, so... Uh, can you hear me now? Jerk, whenever you're ready to... Um, well, Ready? mind uh, giving us a little bit of backstory to those who aren't familiar with you. You're not your dumb. Own story. Hold on, what what's booming kid saying? Uh, 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 no, I don't. I don't hate you. I, I don't I know where that hear him. came from. No, he typed it. Oh, here we go. This is a good move. Uh, backstory. I don't really know. What to... Yeah. Like back some, yeah, some you general racist background racist stuff about one. you. No. Muslims aren't a race. How about Donald Trump jerks? Donald Trump jerks. That would I support him. Donald Trump. Oh, Donald Trump. Yeah, right that's wing. a, that's that's a story possible. that doesn't look like it's going to have a happy ending. No. Uh, you used to <laughs> so, Trump? I used to like Trump, right? I mean... When it was right, him and Hillary, right, right, it was just right. him and Hillary running. Um, but now he seems to just be a regular politician, going back yeah, on his promises. he's turned out to be the I'm same right as all now. the other ones here in the USA Inc. I'm right wing now. At least your politicians can do math. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So now he's he just seems to be just a regular politician, except now he. Uh, you know, he doesn't have a filter, and he just says whatever comes to mind first. First thing that pops into his mind, and that's, <laughs> that's not exactly a good thing. I don't like him. I don't like him. What's the difference between a What's child and a spouse? Oh, <laughs> 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 Nothing if you're Muslim. Yeah, it's like, it's right. Right. 
Was? I appreciate your humor, Blaine. <laughs> yes. Yeah, a lot of you sound really muddled. What is this anymore? We are. I can't hear you. Alright, so. In, um. Jerk, in the. Where were you when you, like, started, um. Like, uh, in the political human spectrum? Like, before where you are now, um, where were you before? Um. I was, uh, I guess somewhere between a centrist and a conservative. You know, I, I didn't really know a whole lot mm -hmm. <laughs> back then. So, I mean, just, you know, just what I grew up listening to in good old Texas. Who did you listen to? <laughs> and, uh, just what my parents say. Uh, <laughs> what I heard. Over, over the years. We have to turn back to the chat. What? Yes. 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 I'm joining a lot, a lot of conversations now. Well, uh, you might want to dwindle them down. Don't <laughs> let yourself be overwhelmed by too many conversations. Um, I'm having a hard time hearing <laughs> kids react to the Holocaust. <laughs> what? Yeah, kids react to the Holocaust. Just another fake reality show. I need a story. Well, I already have one. Anyway, anyone want to hear it? <laughs> Marianne already heard, heard, heard yeah, it. Yeah, I can -E barely hear you. Ugh. Just another fake reality show. No, I don't, I don't think that's fake. I can hear I you a little bit better now. I think that. Uh, show Man, I'm not going into that rabbit hole right now. <laughs> yeah. Well, anyway, uh, please continue. Um, yeah, so over time, I became more libertarian. Uh, here we are. Well, um, how did you first, um, start, uh, going down that way? What, what got you, who, or what got you, um, to, um, uh, think down that pathway? What, what opened up, um, to just got you thinking about things? Who or what got you thinking about things? <laughs> well, I guess it, uh, uh... I guess when I just... At some point, I just decided to, you know, open my... Well, what's oh. Alright. Okay, I, I don't know what that was. <laughs> I didn't hear anything. I don't know, I think my mic just went out. Oh. Um, uh, yeah, so I guess, you know. Hopefully I go next. Yeah. What the hell is that? Somebody's Wayne, blowing their nose. It. it sounds like. It sounds like an elephant. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, crap. You left. Oh, he'll be back, I'm sure. Maybe he's fixing his mic right now. Sorry around this phone. How I got here now is. Can't see this. Marianne already heard it. Yeah, I'm here. No, I was talking about like how I got here. Remember in the stream? Uh, with DC, they'll be heretic, all that. Oh, uh, will anybody else be joining? I don't think so. I don't, I don't think anybody else will be joining. 
Quinn, it looks really good. Thank you very much. You have any suggestions? Because the background. I love looks... how you colored that tree. It looks so yeah. realistic. Thank you. Um. Well, let's see. Can I... Um. I have, yeah, a, I, I have a suggestion. You have a suggestion for the yep. background or something? Yes. We don't want to hear anything. How about you, how about you kick <laughs> out the communist dictatorship back there? Oh, God. Guys, can you Welcome stop back. over each other? Okay, uh, I think right. I got that fixed. Oh, <laughs> yeah, what I was saying, though, um... It's like I used to be a Christian conservative, you know, mm -hmm. and uh, so I, you know, I kind of after like watching all these political guys, like a lot, a lot of these guys were atheists, right? So I kind yeah. of like they opened me up to the whole uh, other side of the argument, I guess. So once once I opened my mind up to that, I guess so, uh, you know, because the only way to really change your mind is to open your mind to opinions, to new opinions. So. Mm -hmm. Once I yeah, that, really just, good yeah, atheist channel. Have you ever heard of Dark Matter 2525? I have not. Uh, oh, it's a great channel. He does these really good animations that are both funny. It's like funny atheist comedy. And and is also his uh, um, really big, think, deep, dramatic more dramatic series called Power Corrupts. And it doesn't just um, question religion, but it also questions political stuff, too. That's pretty neat. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a great channel. I like it a lot. Yeah, I, I highly recommend you check out Dark Matter 2525. It's just, you could just type that in uh, YouTube, all one word, and you'll find it. The profile picture looks like a cartoon angel. Yeah, well, you see, the funny thing is that it wasn't really the atheists that shook my faith in God. It was kind of the church itself. Really? <laughs> yeah, that tends to happen. Yeah. I remember, you know, struggling for a while, and then I went to youth group one day, and <laughs> I, the sermon basically, basically the sermon was, like, they were talking about uh, Judas and how God allowed him to... Uh, be possessed by Satan <laughs> in order to yeah. um, fulfill the prophecy, I guess. And and then I realized that... What is this? Religion of Star Wars? That, 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 Judas' whole purpose in the world was to betray Jesus so he can get crucified, but he still went to hell anyway, even though that was God's plan for him. Uh, <laughs> and I'm like, wait a minute. <laughs> God loves us all, but he, <laughs> but he's gonna send us down. <laughs> so it's his plan. <laughs> so yeah, the whole thing just kind of, my whole world shattered. <laughs> yeah, that that is uh, kind of a crazy way to put it. I never heard of it <laughs> quite told that quite that way. But yeah, but you see it in the Bible all the time, like in the in the Old Testament of. Where the Pharaoh, um, like, pretty much God forces him to uh, keep the Israelites enslaved. It says that he hardens his heart, and then the Pharaoh says, no, <laughs> we will not let your people go. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, yeah. That, that, that start me, started me on my, my path, I guess. Well, I've listened to my dad make fun of Christianity... And, um, like, uh, he was skeptical about Christianity ever since he was a boy, and he calls it, he's, uh, he's called it, um, zombie apocalypse cannibal cabal because of Jesus rising from, being resurrected from the dead, and, uh, the whole thing about the Eucharist. Ooh, drink his blood. The wine is his blood. Yeah. Bread is his body. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I'm trying to find something. I've lost it. Yeah, it's really creepy when you think about it. Yeah. The whole, the whole ritual behind communion is really, really and the creepy. mythology, um, it's... 
the mythology within Christian Christianity, it's not exactly original either. And there's the part where two the two books were taken out of the Bible like years ago. Uh, oh the book yeah, of, well, I mean the whole Bible was put together by uh, Constantine, and they they adapted the whole religion to fit into Roman uh, uh, lifestyle, I guess. <laughs> If it, they molded the religion to fit their lifestyle because you know the whole, uh, going to church on Sunday that was a Roman, uh, that was a Roman thing. <laughs> their pagan religion. Have you ever heard of the Coptic Greek Bible? I do not believe I have. Well, that has only just the Old Testament, not the New Testament. Yeah. That's what that's what I remember my dad saying. Um, hold on. Actually, I have something written that I've sent it um, to a friend of my dad and I. And since he's like blinder than a bat, I've had to type this up for him word for word. Um, it, it, it does explain somewhat about the Bible. Hold on. No, I don't want to open it. Okay, it was the five denominations of Christianity or something like that, the file is called. Hold on. Here we go, five denominations of Christianity. Here we go. Yeah, my dad, he took um, a college course that was like, I think it was called um, the history of religion. All right, here's like the entire message that I typed up. Most people are not trained in arguing through philosophical truths. They think because they studied it in class or read in a debate book that they're prepared to analyze the truths or falsehoods that we are surrounded with. It is many to me that supposed educated people fall for lies offered as eternal truths. Example, when you try to explain to a Christian believer that the only result of a virgin birth would be a female, that spontaneous egg division can only result in a clone of the mother. This is known as OO Genesis. Their immediate response to that, their God made nature and somehow is beyond natural law. How much harm, how much harm in, the, in lost knowledge was caused by the Spanish explorers when they went to the main cities and the priests with them held up their religious symbol, the cross. Do you know what this is? The priests asked. The main priest responded, yes, it's a cross. The cord ring of the universe into active and passive principles. Poor heathens, burn their books. All we have left are their card pictographs of their burning sites. Imagine the knowledge that was destroyed by people so advanced that they devise a calendar based on cycles. The long count, mm -hmm. which is a 25,000 year cycle, closed in December 21st, 2012. It was four seconds off. Bunch of amateurs, huh? Mm -hmm. In our nation today, we struggle against what is known as the Christian right. There are five denominations of Christian entity. The first one, Mithras, was around the Mediterranean Sea 200 years before Christ's alleged birth. All seven sacraments that the Christians practice come from this one theism. There is only one God. In 74 AD, aka after the Common Era, the Coptic Christians wrote their version of the Christian faith. They had a better chance of talking to and recording what happened. Coptic Greek was the Esperanto of its time. 
They are a denomination by themselves. Most people never heard of them until ISIS started beheading them. They've been around since 74 AD. Next denomination, written in 150 AD in the language Aramaic, which was the common language spoken and written by Jesus and his followers. They are called Gnostic, meaning ones who know what to believe. The agnostic doesn't know what to believe. This denomination claimed that they had the secret teachings of Christ. 228 AD, in what was the Constant Constantinople, Turkey, the Curio, Roman, bro bro Roman power brokers, and the Greek Orthodox bishops wrote the Pauline scriptures, which now dominate Christianity. They plagiarized the Hebrew book Septuagint, they called the Old Testament, which is a cut and paste job. In 300 AD, they eliminated the second book called Jubilee from their text. This was the book that described the history of the nine daughters and nine sons of Adam and Eve. We'll talk more about that at another time. In 400 AD, they eliminated the book of Enoch, which stated the 200 watchers. Um, angels left behind when their fellow space travelers left. The whole purpose of uh, eliminating... Oh. What? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it sort of goes on. I can yeah, see why they might want to eliminate that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So... Oh, I'm really a bit lost. I thought we were talking about Christianity, now we're talking about Star Wars. <laughs> no. <laughs> um, the part here was um, in explaining the purpose of eliminating these two books, Enoch and Jubilee, of the Old Testament, was to get rid of eight generations that, that existed between Adam and Abraham. They had to get it down to 40 then from Abraham to Jesus, they only had 38. They made two up. The purpose of this was so that they could claim Jesus as the suffering servant, the, servant, the true Messiah. But if Jesus was as they claim, as a virgin birth, how in the world can they claim he comes from Adam? What a bunch of hogwash. So, even the basic principles of their denomination and 157 sects are based on historic fantasy at best. The fifth denomination are the Mormons, in which the fourth denomination is what they don't recognize as real Christians. As a matter of fact, they don't recognize themselves, and the 157 sects don't get along at all. None of them can face historical and archaeological archaeological finds that show they are wrong. They don't accept the truths in the science of genetics, which show how infantile the myths are that they believe in. And that's it. That's all. That's all I wrote. Damn. Yeah. Just destroyed the whole religion. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, if you want, um, if you want to hear more f um, to what Dad knows, if you would be interested in it, you could let me know. He's a yeah, really smart was... guy. One of the smartest people I know. And I'm not just saying that. Sounds like... Yeah, he knows a lot. He's uh, very much into science and um, into some math. And, cough, um, cough. you, uh, space, science and space. And, um, philosophy. Cough, cough. I'm going to screw this speech. Oh. What are you drawing? It's the uh, compass art. She she's drawing for her comic, yes. her um art comic on uh, Deviant Art. Here's the whole thing. If, if you want to learn, I'm sorry. Look. 
I don't know what you said, but I forgive you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I kind of missed what I you said. said I'm is on falling asleep. Oh, you're falling asleep? Alright, well, uh, good night, Sarah. I said I'm falling asleep on you, not like a friend. We can't hear what you're saying, I'm sorry. Yo, are you having a stroke? Because your words are getting all slurred up. Did you say that I was on cocaine? <laughs> I did not hear a single word of that. Yeah, we didn't hear anything. Your mic is really metallic. Holy yeah, shit, I think you might want to want leave the call and come back in. Because... Uh, sometimes my own audio quality comes out as crappy, so that means I'd uh, that it fixes it fixes itself when I leave the call and come back in. That's worked for me. I hope it works for you. Yeah. So. Um, you had uh, a lot of second thoughts on Christianity, Christianity. So, um, anything significant happen from there, jerk? Oh, yeah. I mean, I guess uh, ever ever since my faith in God got shaken, I became less and less conservative because a lot of their arguments are just. Uh, I mean, just based on that, and then Religious. once that foundation, yeah, once that foundation is destroyed, you, you, yeah, you if, if your god, to, if your god isn't real, you can't force people to, yeah, <laughs> to, to live by that. It's just, yeah. <clears throat> so, and with dark matters, power corrupts. There's definitely a couple of episodes. That you're gonna have to watch more than once to understand. Yeah. I think it was probably. episodes five and six. It's just a lot that that is covered. It's just his he's the way he thinks and the how he creates and it's just wow. I don't find many people on YouTube like him. I'll have to check his stuff out. Yeah, I did mention um, him in a previous uh, webisode of and and Capistani Lounge. It was through Discord. All right, can I maybe change the subject quick? Is Boom Kid still there? No. Ah, oh, oh, damn it! He's gonna suggest something, and then someone interrupted him. Dang it! Where's going, guys? <laughs> oh, so sorry, I'll go hang myself now. No. no. <laughs> Don't do that. Nah. Yeah. Let's see. I taking some pictures that I took. I'm gonna turn those into some assets. Yeah. It's kind of cool to watch you how you uh, work your magic on the oh, thank you. art magical. here. All right, let me see here. I'm gonna take. The, I want to take this little section right here. Yeah. Because um, I know there's. Let me see. I know there's a way to do it, but let me see here. Because there's like this. Where it, like, Hi. It hey. Back. Much Hello. better. Yes, I can understand you. Boom Kid was just like, who are you? I'm just like, I'm Maria's friend. She's like, are you a vocabulary? I'm like, uh, I don't know what you mean by that. I'm sorry. I'm done. <laughs> are you a voluntary capitalist? I think that's what he was asking. Yeah, or vote Hello? capitalist or something like that. It's um, what our friend Mr. Dapperton calls himself. Is there himself. any other person that calls himself a vocab or is Dapperton the only one? Um, I thought I thought there was someone in the comments section under his video that identified as that, but I forget who it is. 
I'm not really familiar with the person. I think it's just Mr. Oh. Dapperton. It's um, it's yeah, redundant. This, uh, this de <laughs> yeah, this this the uh, this debate between the two sects of ANCAPs is uh, really interesting to watch. Like, I, I haven't really, I don't really have a side in this debate, so I'm just watching both sides. Uh, yeah, make, same. Uh, I'm sort of, uh, I'm sort of just stepping back and watching. I'm not really following on the the vocab thing. I just find it strange. People are starting well, to. Con Conspiracies that uh, Dapperton isn't actually an anarchist, that he's oh, the Republican trying to be ed edgy. Uh, huh? Is it what I have now? Uh, huh? Nope. You're still. I mean, I don't know if she's still she's recording. Like, but... <laughs> I am. Okay, cool. I caught the wrong one. Let me fix that. Yeah. Did you hear what I was saying before? <laughs> yep. I mean, what I was saying before, I ended this call. I mean, I, I went off the call. Oh, um... Did, did you... What? Oh, you want to catch up on what, um... Well, you didn't miss much when, um, you left, you jumped out of the call. No, I, I said, I'm sorry if I'm kind of falling asleep on you. I mean, I'm not going to sleep, but you always do that on people. Oh, well, it's all right. I'm sorry. It's all right if you do fall asleep. I've had that Darth Revan was has been in voice call and he has fallen asleep. He's from Canada, by the way. He's, um, Wait. we often voice chat Mr. Jeff is falling asleep? Huh? Oh, come on, that doesn't look great still. Darth Revan. Mr. He falls asleep in voice call. Um, sometimes. Huh. And I just message him goodnight and leave the voice call. <laughs> and once it was, like, before um, I got my community strike, it was sometime before I got my community strike, in which, mm -hmm. um... It was it during in the middle of a live stream and Riven fell asleep sometime like I don't know towards the end or in the middle of the live stream. <laughs> wow. Yeah. It happens. Oh, and sometimes um, you could hear his dogs. He has two dogs. <laughs> oh yeah. Right. Yeah, he has a a little dog and a big dog. The little one is named Zoom, and his bigger dog is uh, Golder. He named them both himself. Zoom is the really funny one. <laughs> it, it, the more I think um, Zoom is the more vocal one. <laughs> it was um, during one of my live streams in which the dog, which uh, Zoom was very vocal, <laughs> doing the growly, <laughs> yeah, I think I remember playful that. I think growly I was on that noise. Stream. I think I was actually on that stream. Yeah, you were. Yeah, yeah. Koi. Yeah, Koi was on the stream. She arrived uh. in sort of later on. Oh yeah, and she was having audio problems, audio troubles. Yeah, uh, I'm sorry about that. It's fine. Shit. Um, sorry, not you this thing. I'm trying to think of how I'm gonna do this. Also, the uh, I just realized there's people on their no is that guy no that guy's not on his cell phone okay because hmm. this is oh is he face palming but he yeah. read whatever Trump said <laughs> well, what was uh, that take... about about having a military force in space <laughs> so, <laughs> have y'all seen that yet <laughs> no that would be oh, something God. though. <laughs> Let me see if I can find it again. All right. <laughs> this is ridiculous. <laughs> Are they preparing to go to war with aliens or what? <laughs> did you say? Uh, did you say? Atom Atomic Incap tweeted something about it. Hmm? <laughs> oh my god. He's... 
Aww. You okay, Sarah? I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I punch. I punch myself in the chest. I punch <laughs> myself. How do you keep doing that to yourself? Stop hurting yourself. Okay. All right, I found it. <laughs> All right. We should have a new force called the Space Force. It's like the army and the navy, but for space, because we're spending a lot of money on space. <laughs> <laughs> the President of the United States, everyone. Uh, <laughs> I thought I was too dirty. Ugly politics has gone so ridiculous. Oh, I don't even care about Trump anymore. It's just like it's all white at this point. <laughs> I don't care. Idiocracy in real life. I still haven't seen that movie, but I've heard a great deal about it. Alright, that's a movie. Ah, oh, where the hell was I on here? Ooh. Yep, so... Uh, ridiculous politics, ugly politics, bleh. Oh, that's a nice looking well. Yeah, <laughs> water well. These are all pictures I took at the uh, botanical gardens in Canada back when I was in high school. I think, yeah, I think it was high school. Well, that's a nice building. Yeah. Um, I'm just trying to figure out a few things with this because I wanted to use this image, the black and white one here, but um, there's like the problem with the trees getting in the way. Oh, yeah. Like, the thing is about that one guy who looks like on, he's on his cell phone. Uh, <laughs> oh, yeah. Because this, this is the 1920s. They didn't have cell phones, obviously. <laughs> so. Oh, it's a time traveler. A time traveler. And for some reason, he decided to go to some random building in Japan. It's yeah. not Japan. <laughs> Well, technically, this isn't a fictional universe. It's not mine. It's uh, Legend of Korra. Uh, yeah. Um, it's a comic that um, she's doing that's... Yeah, it's a fan comic. This is a location I made up for it. Yeah, it's I based on the Legend I of I never Korra. watched past the first season of Korra, so... Yeah, same. I'm... I've been more of a fan like, of uh, the I first season. I don't know, but I'm, I'm not for <laughs> Well, the thing is, I saw that live-action movie first, and then I got oh, into the yeah, cartoon that's... series. Of like, hey, why is it why um uh, why is uh, isn't Sora this funny in the the live-action movie? This is awesome, and I have the entire series on DVD now. Yeah, I don't know why I didn't watch it when it was airing. I don't know. I was too good for it, I guess. Same. Me and my, me, my yeah, eight-year-old I, I, self. I, I was, was too late good to, to discover it, it, but I'm glad I did. Um, yeah, it's a great series. Yeah, better late than never. It was a great <laughs> series. <sighs> I gotta fix that. Um, let's see here. Okay, I gotta erase part of this, like the black part outside of it. Can you like? Erase. Oh, what? can you like, um, yeah, you could, um, what are you saying? Shrink the, the brush, yeah. Or it's the eraser, but whatever. Or the Avatar whatever. universe contributes to white genocide because there aren't any <laughs> white people in it. Wait, what? <laughs> He's joke. He's just saying a dumb joke. <laughs> Let me see. I hope. Wait, <sighs> Wait then. Um. <clears throat> never mind. I'm gonna take the white out. So, let me see how this looks in a minute. Or actually, right now. There. Okay, that one. Let me put the white back in for right now, though. That looks a little ah. better. Yeah. All right. Let me. I want to get rid of the. Yes, I like the way this looks so far. Mm -hmm. And the numerous gun countries with gun laws have considerably less shootings. 
They have considerably less guns, too. Yeah. Huh? Wait, what are you talking about? I don't know, I'm arguing with some idiot on Twitter. <laughs> yep, I find a bunch of idiots on Twitter. There's this one, um, Titoist. I, I think I already mentioned him, um, on your live stream. Jerk. And the and uh, Centennial yeah. Caesar did not like him. It's called he's yeah. called uh, Tito's pen and paper. Yeah, I've, I've argued with him. Hungry again. He called me an ang hat. <laughs> I'm like, I'm not an ang hat. <laughs> he's like, yes, you are. I'm like, okay, well, you're stupid. I'm done. <laughs> what are you then? The guy is hostile. What guy? He did. Um, he. Um, we did have a civil, um, voice chat once, uh, and mostly he's hostile. Hey, who he's is just rude and about? hostile most of the time. What are you talking about? Tito's pen and paper. Oh. That person. He's no. a communist statist. <laughs> yeah, oh. he's a commie that likes market socialism. Is it bad that I haven't slept for like three days? Hmm? Restricting access to guns may save lives. Did you hear what I just said? No. Oh. I did not. I, I, said, I said, is it bad that I haven't slept for three days? Yes. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> You're gonna have to sleep eventually. Uh, I've just been having problems in my head right now, stuff going on. Hmm. What is it, like, uh, insomnia, sleep deprivation? Oh. Well, my friend has, um, had lung cancer and he didn't tell me first. So, apparently I was the one who told last, so he told me. Last that he had lung cancer and he just told everyone first. Hmm. So, yep. Let me see. I don't want those. Uh, let me actually take this. Uh, I don't want these people to clash with the rest of the image, so I'm just gonna erase them. Hey, can I call you guys back tomorrow? I'm having enough to sleep. Yeah, you need to sleep. Yeah, you need to go to bed. Alright. Yeah, you have a good night. Bye, friend Sarah. Bye. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> yeah, I'll invite her to my Discord when it, whenever she next time she's on Discord. She'll be in Ancapa Stanis. And hey, I'll invite her to, um, your server, Koi. My, oh, okay. Yeah, just, um... Uh, well, if she wants to read the comic or whatever, that's fine. Or either way, I don't care. Um, yeah. We'll have two different servers, but I just... I don't really keep track of the other one, though, honestly. Yeah, I, um... I'm in many servers, and I can't keep track of all of them, either. And there's this one that... Like... That's sort of, like... A social support group that I sort of joined, you know, just for f basic life and stuff. Not exactly political stuff, but it's just it's. It, I call them my introvert support group. Oh, I'm really hungry. I'm gonna get something to eat again in a second. I have yet to give them an update on um, life, important stuff about life. Uh, Dante's uh, at me. Uh, why is Blaine not in the group anymore? I'll be right back. I need food. Alrighty. And, um... Jerk, you're also... You're sort of like the minimal government libertarian? Yeah, that's my current stance. Well, what I say, what, what, I can, what I do suggest is 
keep going. Don't stop there. Well, um, I'm not really sure that anarchism could really be achieved, at least not at this point. Um, at least not in my lifetime, I, I do not believe. Probably um, not. Um, but I know I just can't go back to being a statist. I can't. I just cannot um, see government as legitimate anymore. Um, the, the one guy that got me really thinking about this stuff um, was Larkin Rose quite a mind that he's got and uh he's really good at explaining things through logic and in layman's terms and i've, I've seen some of his stuff and that's that was the gateway to me thinking of things that i've never thought before and then i've i've went over the and i and i've uh, after sometimes i've seen uh shane killian's introduction to the first principles of logic. I was like, hey, that makes sense, too. And, um... Yeah. Really interesting stuff, and I've been... I'm still researching stuff, still learning stuff. But I know that no, socialism, it's, it's so <laughs> flawed. And there's this, like, one person that I'm sort of buddies with, but um, young man from Greece who types in fluent English. Um, and he, he can understand English, but cannot speak it or, or something. I don't know. But we pr just text each other back and forth and um, we, it's been a very civil debate. He hasn't gone, like, nasty, not anywhere near as nasty as Tito's pen and paper. But, um... We've had it civil, but, uh, in our conversations, I'm just skeptical of socialism so far. There's, like, I don't know, it's something, it's, it's a weird negative connotation of the profit motive. And profit is financial gain, and, um, it's just not clear on, uh, his viewpoints on, um, uh, the, the profit motive and um, having any respect for Karl Marx because, I don't know, there's stuff about the Communist Manifesto I'm that back. I strongly disagree with. I'm back. Such as oh, yeah. the abolition of private property and the abolition of uh, the fam the nuclear family union. Yeah, that, they just, they just want to kill the bourgeoisie. And, uh, yeah, <laughs> violent revolution. <laughs> Yeah. No. <laughs> yeah, and it, it's not like okay. anything would change either. Okay. Like, would they? Would the violence truly end? Not likely. Would the good guys really? Um, would the good good guys really exist? Not likely. It would be a population all full of good guys. Like not to likely. Accomplish, to accomplish what they want, it's, they'd have to give a lot of power to the state to overthrow them. Yeah. Bourgeoisie. And when you give the state that much power, it's not going to hand it over. I mean, this is this is illustrated really well in Animal Farm, which has been banned from China now. <laughs> yeah, along with 1984. And, and the letter they, in. <laughs> yeah, that, I heard that was temporary, though. <laughs> so we're calling it Chia now? Yeah. <laughs> it's the People's, the People's Republic of Chia. Yeah. Yeah. Ch -ch -ch -chia. <laughs> that was so funny. We have to respect their culture. It's, yeah. It's the I, I um that was last that was um on Sunday. Um I talked about that with Revan. He thought that was hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, and the, uh, something about banning Winnie the Pooh as well. <laughs> but yeah, because, the most uh, ridiculous is banning the letter N. Yeah, that that's... Uh... <laughs> yeah, it's just a letter. Oh, it's like a Why revolutionary is the thing. Why so offensive? It's, it's just a letter. Some, 
I don't know. I think uh, something like some revolution group is using the letter N uh, <laughs> to rebel against him, I guess. I don't know why I don't know either. how. It how doesn't is, make any it's, sense. It's like a secret code or something. How is I don't the letter know. N going to help? But <laughs> <laughs> if, they want, if they want to do that, fine. I'll, whenever I see the word China, I'll just cross out the letter N. <laughs> <laughs> Do my part. <laughs> <laughs> Call it Spurs. Chia from now on. <laughs> Chia. Ch Ch yeah. Um. Yes, yeah, so I I know I went over that article. Um. No, wait, that was two episodes ago. Yeah. When I went oh. over about that ridiculous article. Mm. What else? Oh, that's what I also talked about. First talked about Dark Matter 2525. Yeah, I think it was just Darth Revan and me then. My screen shares I might want I might want to pick a different day of the week um, if um, I'll plan ahead and let people know ahead of time that I'm gonna do something on Sunday and if uh, hear no hear from nobody I might pick just a different day or night I know so I know so hasn't been doing what I've been doing what's that? The OBS recording. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, since he started, since he was streaming, live streaming on Mondays, I didn't want to compete with him. I actually wanted to join him. So that's why I moved. That's why I moved uh, my live streams back. <laughs> and I, I didn't want to do it on Saturday because that's, that would be um, competing with my friend, uh, Sir Conservatarian. And he invites me to his stream sometimes. So, no, I didn't want to do Saturday night. Alright, that looks good. I just gotta move it down here. There, how does that look? Right well, here. even if Anarchy does not... Even if, um true anarchy does not happen in our lifetime that's still no reason to um actually have any support for government at all one step at a time in my opinion anyway <clears throat> my honest opinion like the way that schools are run these days how what happened what's oh, happened to public yeah, yeah, schooling I've researched. I'm very much against the public school system. Yeah, I've, I've researched um, a lot into um, how it was in the past. Anita Hoag's story. Ever heard of her? No. No. Oh, she was one brave woman, one brave, courageous woman, mother of three from Pennsylvania. And this was sometime in the 80s. Um. Well, what, what started as a simple complaint towards an assessment test, it was a profiling test disguised as academia, and she wanted to know more about this test, and uh, people in the school said no, and they, uh, until uh, she finally got to look at it, but she wasn't allowed to leave the school with it, and then they sent her a bunch of papers and stuff. Which they shouldn't have done because it explained more about what, who was for the test, what made up the test. It's it's quite a Pandora's box of things. Yeah. I thought I had that. Ah, here it is. Right here. Um. According to the back the summary of the back of the book that I've read, uh, 
education bureaucrats in Pennsylvania never dreamed they would one day be on the losing side of a fight against Washington counterparts, whom they previously had imagined to be allies, even less did officials in Washington dream they would be outmaneuvered in opening a Pandora's box of white papers, position papers, working papers, official memos, appropriations, review boards, secure lists, and task forces that eventually would reveal one of the most unique and mind-boggling cases of misrepresentation in American history. Anita Hogue herself did not expect to be declared the winner and standing up against the U.S. government, but um, this she it never made to court, and uh, she never had the chance to make her case public. Mm. And she's still um, standing up for civil family rights. She's still not. She's still doing. She's still out there doing a whole lot of research and spreading the word out on Twitter and on a few websites such as the Freedom Outpost and NewsWithViews.com. And one of the reasons in which voting is just voting, especially in this day and age. Um, in USA Inc., it's just not, um, credible, is, um, it hasn't been credible for years, listed here in the allegations that went through this investigation, allowing certain government agencies to be used as pawns of a private, of private organizations seeking to redefine, if not revamp, America's social and economic framework, thereby placing these government agencies in the position of conspiring to overthrow the U.S. Constitution. Yeah. <laughs> if voting mattered, then why wasn't that uh, not allowed to happen? What, if, if voting mattered, then why was that allowed to happen? You know? Shit. Or, sorry, I was just try to fix my art here. So many oh, details. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'd be so fussy about that <laughs> myself if I, if I was doing that. I don't know, I probably have an easier time with that with the the software Clip Studio Paint. Oh, yes, it's such a That's what it's called. Yes. Or just Clip Studio. Yes, it's fantastic. Mm. Yeah, I've yeah, done little things like that. The latest start work on the Deviant Art Miro. I used to animate a lot, and uh, like when you're doing stuff like that with all the details, you you know every single mistake you make. Because you're, <laughs> yeah. You're, so it's just like hoping nobody else sees it. Oh, let me see. I got that. I gotta. All right. Wait. That goes over this. Wait. Why is that still clipping through there? That's on the very top. Why is that clipping through it? No, oh, that's the wrong one. Wait. <laughs> okay, I have a blank layer called fence. What gives? Okay, let's see. Um, hey, what the so. hell gives? Ah, oh, that's still in the same layer. Are you kidding me? And this guy who was one of the architects of what I call Rotten Core, he's still um, president of the college board. Oh, uh, Common Core? Yeah, I call it Rotten oh, Core. Oh, yeah, that, that's a, that is a complete joke. Yeah. It's just so gross. It's rotten to the core. What are you talking about? And um, the guy who... Com common Core math. Yeah, and uh, and English. Oh, they've got English now. And it, it's is... been that way know, with I'm... English. That this guy David Coleman, you should look up the video and that's titled David Coleman and his first, um, in his own words. Well, it didn't say anything about English, but I did read something, um, called what is Common Core dot WordPress. 
in which um, was dedicated to like research and study uh, studying um, the the horrible things about Common Core, and it was met, and David Coleman was mentioned in there a couple of times in which he like cut out half of uh, literary classics from English class and put like um, informational texts such as instruction manuals and uh, what should be in actually in history class but not English class which is like Federal Reserve Acts or something like that. Hmm. No, I might look into yeah, this he was not a nice guy, and he's still president of the college board. What college board? Oh, sorry. The oh. U.S. College Board. Oh, okay. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah, he's he was never a qualified educator to begin with. Yeah. What what's what else is so bad about Common Core is that you don't have to be a qualified educator to teach anymore. And uh, you don't have to, you don't uh, need actual educators to review tests anymore. You can just hire someone off of Craigslist. You gotta be kidding me! Ugh. Yeah, it's, it's ridiculous. Like I saw that this uh, this kid got marked up on a test wrong because he answered the question wrong. It was something like uh, five times three or something like that, and he wrote three times five. Yeah. Like, it's it's the same answer. Yeah. But he got it wrong. Yeah. Because he didn't so write stupid. five times three. <laughs> Multiplication is commutative, you idiots. Yeah. It's the same problem. Yeah. Okay, I fixed that. And the problem. English part that's messed up too. It's like there's no characters, no plot. No central conflict, no themes and in instruction manuals. It's just instructions. Like what? Mm. Like comprehension skills is just following instructions now. Apparently. Yeah, that That's doesn't boring. make any sense. <sighs> That's just boring. killing off yeah, I'll, I'll um, any passion for That's reading. Just... No wonder why people don't read books much anymore. Well, not in my area. Yeah, I wouldn't know. I've, I haven't been in public school since fucking first grade. Hmm. Lucky. I oh, was, got... I was spared. I was spared from this madness. That's great, you lucky soul. Mm. <laughs> I never. Um. It was. I wasn't in school anymore when uh, Obama and that Secretary of Education guy, or whatever his name was, um, I, Alexander or something, I forget. But um, I wasn't in school when uh, when it was that race to the top, and then followed by uh, Rotten Core. Rotten Core standards. I uh, graduated in 2002. Mm. And done. Anita Sorry. Hogue, what she discovered, it delayed, um, it delayed their progress to um, that how bad, how deliberately dumbing down Americans of uh, turned turned out to be. What she did to uh, get the government to um, get rid of that test like uh, standing up to them she only delayed them she never oh. really stopped them she delayed them and I'm glad yeah, she I did because if she hadn't <sighs> then um, you know common rotten core would have come a lot sooner I guess a stupider population is easier to rule over yeah of course of course, because with the population stupid and the tyrants getting away with things, then, you know, they can keep getting away with things and while everyone else is distracted by bread and circuses. Mm. As George Carlin says, they don't want a population of critical thinkers. 
um, people just uh, dumb uh, people dumb enough, but not so dumb, not so dumb that they can't like uh, read instructions and just run the machines and stuff. Just gotta swallow your. Oh, I <laughs> need a few minutes. To that. This idiot on Twitter. <laughs> I'm gonna need a few minutes to respond to that. Oh, what's what stupid <laughs> oh, stuff you is need, he saying? You need to swallow your pride in order to save some kids, man. Yeah, man, I want kids to die. That's why I against gun control. I oh, love dead oh, children. That Fuck you, those... you fucking faggot. <laughs> Fuck you. You must be a liberal. <laughs> oh my god. Liberals are the most insufferable people. <laughs> <laughs> Quote unquote liberals. Yeah. There was this one. I did see the new video that was such a, a ridiculous cartoon. Cartoony, um, in support of, uh, like, gun control. It was so bad. Dapperton did a great job in debunking that video. I love dead children. Hey, are you talking about KKO? <laughs> the. Okay, KO or whatever. No, it's a, it's a different cartoon. It's the one oh. where there's this guy that compared guns to cats. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> what an idiot. How can you compare them to cats? That's retarded. Guns all by themselves don't kill people. Yeah. Yeah, well, it doesn't, it doesn't really make any sense. It's like, gun control, you make it illegal to buy guns. Okay, great. Now, the only people that are armed are criminals in this state. Yeah. <laughs> While abiding citizens, like, criminals don't respect the law. <laughs> They're gonna buy guns no. anyway. <laughs> that reminds me of the, this meme picture, um, in which there was a guy with a ski mask over his head, and he had, like, a gun holding in one hand, and he's like, okay, uh, let me check the law books first. <laughs> yeah. They're like, if they're planning on committing crimes with the gun, anyway, they don't, they already don't respect the law. Yeah. <laughs> Just making it illegal to have the gun, like, it's not gonna change anything. No, Prohibition it's Prohibition doesn't work. Prohibition has never worked. No. Ever. No, the war on drugs has never worked, either. Same as the war on guns, and the war on terror. Hope that's done. Do you guys want to take a look soon? Alright. There's see to the... Yeah, it looks good, Koi. Thank you. Looks really good. Alright, yeah, that's pretty much done, but let me see. I have another thing to work on. Uh, here, I gotta work on one more thing. Whoops, that's not it. Alrighty. Uh, where the hell is it? Oh, no, that's not it again! Stupid. <laughs> um, hmm. Here, I think this is it. He's open, there we go. Oh, yeah. This is the racetrack itself, so. Are you gonna make it, like, dirt? Um... Yeah. I'm really hungry still. After all those crackers. <laughs> now, let's see. Um, these two things right here, those are fire pits. Yeah. Um, let me see. Where was. Actually, I should pull up the last one. I'm gonna blast this guy. <laughs> <laughs> Have fun. Oh, I, I'm, I'm, I'm really pissed right now. <laughs> right, oh, wait, why is that? Oh. Well, that's gonna go and. Oh, let me see here. 
the last time I had so much fun with one of those liberals was he was being so dishonest about taxation. So much special pleading. And um, he had a severe case of contempt prior to investigation, a.k.a. confirmation bias. And it's just going going nowhere with him. It was just going around in circles. And I'm like, okay, just keep on. Uh, just vote harder, push harder. Keep on choosing the lesser of two miserable choices. And never focus on anything better. And, and uh, self-ownership oh. is mind-body dualism. And... And uh, here's a pseudo scientific article that has nothing to do with self ownership in it to prove my point. See, <laughs> I trolled that guy so hard. <laughs> he was such a cuck. <laughs> and I said, "Well, as, as fun as it was, I think we're not getting any further than circular argumentation at this point." And then I left. Yeah. Oh yeah, there's one more thing I'm gonna need help with. Well, I don't know if we're gonna be able to cover it right away, but it's um. Okay. Oh excuse me. Oh excuse me. The abandoned bar. I'll show you how far I got last night. Alrighty. I just don't want to be up all night again. <laughs> so I keep getting up too late because I keep uh keep staying up really late working on stuff. Mhm. Mm Oh, that didn't work. Wait. Alright, whatever. I don't care. So that's done. That's supposed to be the seating area. Um, here, let me see. Where's the other... I keep getting it mixed up. Alright, well, let me just pull up the abandoned bar one. Might as well. Here's one view of it. Where's this? Oh, is this the tavern? Yes, um, that's gonna come on later. I don't want to say too much about it, because, uh, uh, well, you're recording this, right? Yeah. Yeah, this is gonna be before, I mean, yeah, this is probably... Sneak uh, preview. <laughs> yes, it's a sneak preview, so I can't say much else, but that's gonna be an important scene later on. I think it's gonna be a regular location, actually, but here... The outside, the, out the outside looks like. Yeah, what do you think? Cool. Looks nice. Yeah, it's the inside I gotta work on more. Um, I don't really feel like doing the, the bar though, if I'm honest right now. So I'm really gonna, because the racetrack is the most important, so I gotta finish that yeah. first. Yeah, I've had to um, do more art stuff for myself. There's this original character for my story that I've been write my story that oh, I've been writing that I still yet to, to start drawing. I've been focusing on uh, writing last week. I got three chapters finished. Did you want to see the setup for the standard classroom? I'm getting it up right now. Mm-hmm. How's that look? Oh, nice. Here, I'll show you the other view as well. Ta-da. What do you think? That's the other side of the room. What do you think? Nice lights and uh, yeah. windows. Yeah. Like later on, I'm probably going to add more details because, uh, well, let's see, it doesn't show up that much in the next chapter, so I'm not going to worry about it right now, but I wanted to get some idea of it. Mm hmm. I'm still trying to find. <sighs> Whatever, I don't care. I'm going to look at my front matters thing. I'll see. Hopefully, you won't see too much here. Oh, well, I, might, I might have to do that. I told him to kill himself. I might get banned from Twitter again. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> oh my gosh! Really? You were banned before? Uh, I did. Before? Actually, I did get suspended from Twitter. What? I got you suspended that, from Twitter for jokingly telling somebody to kill themselves. Uh, <laughs> it was a joke, and I got suspended uh, because. Oh, it happened to Revan once. Well, I can't freaking find what I was working on. It's a joke, you faggots. <laughs> yeah, someone got triggered. Come on, what the hell? I can't find that other thing I was working on. Yeah, I'll delete it before I get fucking 
banned. Yeah, there was this one. <laughs> oh, and Esso got temporarily suspended for calling Again. someone a retard. Again. I, 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 I Here, uh, you guys want a sneak peek of what the whole comic looks like? I mean, it's just the setup. It's just a bunch of 3D models, so you're not going to be able to know what's going on anyways. Okay. Or not really. Yeah, see, this is what I have so far. It's like most of the and everything. Can't show you too much, like I said. Yeah, understand. Mm -hmm. I'm kind of on the fence of posting it, like delaying it a little bit, and then posting it on my WordPress so I can re officially release my WordPress because I got it. Mm -hmm. um, that's not the right one again. Damn it! I have no idea what happened to that other. one. Okay, wait. That was the original one, um, but I had to change a lot, so that's not that one that I want. Come on, where the hell is it? Oh, no, no. Come on. Yeah, nope. and Des has been permanently banned from Twitter, and he's on Gab. Who, 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 I need to get on what? Gab more. And uh, libertarianism.club. Oh. All right, that I happened. <laughs> Did you destroy the idiot? <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's hard to type when your fingers are shaking. Why? Why are they shaking? I was pissed. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah. you, you need to swallow your pride. It's for the kids. Don't you care about the kids? Think of the chillins. Yeah. Dude, but they the children. There are literally pedophiles using that argument. So I think you kind of lost the argument with that. <laughs> yeah. Uh, using children as a shield to to hold strong your beliefs. Yeah, yeah that's exactly. great. Well, not... Yeah. But this whole Parkland thing is really disgusting because that's what they're doing, and they're not shy about it at all. Hmm. Well, Tito's pen and paper. He's a. He's just he's, he's just as bad. He's not shy about showing his inner fascist at all. Even though that one voice call with him at his Discord chat was fairly civil, it was like talking to two different people. Like the guy had like a split personality, and he wasn't uh, he didn't deny that he had a fucked up moral compass. Was like everything about poetry, musical theater, and animals. That's animals. like the decent part of them. And whenever you get political, that's uh, oh my god, that's more that dangerous one. side. Space, <laughs> space force is trending on Twitter. <laughs> what? Space force is trending on Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, is it a whole bunch of funny tweets? <laughs> is it Trump. is it like like witty funny or stupid well, funny? It's just people making fun of Trump. <laughs> yeah, okay, I'm gonna be pissed if I accidentally delete everything that I had for that one setup. Oh, Jesus. Well, at least I have this. Yeah. I'm really happy with the way that came out. Oh, yeah, yeah, it looks really and nice. It looks it really here. good. It's, I want to crop it a little bit. That's like bugging me how tall it is there. There, that's better. <sighs> Everyone right. making fun of hashtag Space Force comment. If you think that's fun, well, then you're the joke. <laughs> and I suggest reading <laughs> Reagan's diary. <laughs> They've been at that for quite some time already. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> this is great. Trump's a meme. Yeah. He always has been. Yeah. And Hillary is too. She's a meme yeah, she's uh on her own. Hillary's not Hillary's not very funny. Well Why not, I have three stupid funny, ahead. really stupid funny. <laughs> <laughs> Remember when she barked like a dog? I, I mean, oh, I'm, laugh, I'm laughing now. I'm laughing now, but if she won, 
I would not be laughing. <laughs> yeah. Same. Oh, wait a minute. Now I remember, you fucking dumbass. It would uh, not be funny. Not you, guys. No, no if she won, myself. it wouldn't have been funny. But it was funny when she, with, with the whole dog barking thing. and I don't remember that. We'd probably be living in the fallout. Fucking hell, where the hell is it? Sorry, guys, I'm trying to figure something out that I did. It's fine. <sighs> okay, You're now fine. I think I remember. Alright, yeah, now I remember. I put it on the same... The si I'm oh, trying to cool. say... Oh, put... That looks really good. Right, yeah, let me put the background back on. Yeah, there we go. That looks like it works. Actually, let me take Look at that the city out of the background here. So, the world of Avatar got really advanced in one generation. Yep. Yeah, it did. <laughs> they went from freaking, uh, what, what I guess what no, time frame would you see this was in? No, no like, Anga. You mean the comics? From Anga to Katara. I mean, I, not not Katara. What's her name? Korra? Korra, yeah. That was four generations. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> but still, that's all. <laughs> they got really advanced in a short amount of time. All right, there we go. Uh... All right, yeah, there we go. I was I was losing my shit thinking I accidentally deleted it, but then I remembered. <laughs> oh, duh, it's on the same freaking uh, layer, <laughs> or the same <laughs> pro the same document, I should say. Whoops. Oopsie. All right, what the hell do I yeah, do? Yeah, how long has this been going on? What are you talking about? Oh, the recording? Question. Quite a while now. Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, the recording. Yeah, I guess I could stop. Yeah, cause I'm... No, don't. Yeah, I mean, I'm gonna have to go soon. Okay. Okay. Just... Alright, well, it was good having you on. Yeah. Do you have Discord? Uh, I think I do. I don't really use it. Oh, okay. Well, just asking because I'm on Discord a lot. Well, I'm gonna stop recording. Well, that's all, folks. That's all there is okay, to bye. really talk about. <laughs>